بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد The Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said كل ابن آدم خطأ وخير خطأين توابون The Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said all the children of Adam they make mistakes or they commit sins and the best of those is those who repent to Allah and we can't relay this hadith of the Prophet ﷺ enough because we know that the Ummah is swarming with sins or is filled with sins. As the Prophet ﷺ said, Kulu ibn Adam, all the children of Adam, they commit sins. The problem is, is when we have the intishar or the widespread major sins. And first I'm addressing myself, and that's why I, I, I'm mentioning this. Trying to encourage myself by speaking about it and striving to move away from sin, sinfulness in general, whether it be major or minor, because surely enough, the minor shirk will lead to the major shirk. And as Shaykh al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah said, al-ma'asi barid al-kufr, that the sinfulness is a means to disbelief. That's a means to disbelief. So continuing in sin, continuing in sinful behavior and un-Islamic conduct can lead you to disbelief. And we've seen it. We've witnessed it many times. And when you look even at yourself, when you see that you have certain sins, you continue to repeat. A lot of times you see how weak your iman can get. That no matter what station you believe you are in the religion and how close you believe you are to Allah, that you, you, you see yourself fall. Then they are, you know, so a man is created and they, 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 they can be in a high station. Then they return, then they go to, a, to one of the lowest of the low. And that comes from immersing yourself with sin. So... I invite myself and I invite my brothers and sisters to make tawbah to Allah and leave the sin. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.